Hey pals, we're back to Let's Try Horror, Alan Wake. I'm KM. I'm Shark Pup, and this is the worst. Like, no joke, except for there's ammunition, but I can't open it. Except for when we're doing our sink, our frustration just continues. <laughs> like, past when we hit stop. I said I was going to rant about something. I don't even remember what it is anymore. Uh, <laughs> no, I don't know either. Jeez. Oh, the, 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 the start of the episode was okay. When we were driving around in sunlight, mm-hmm. you know, it, it was just very moody. It was Alan, like, talking to himself. Like, that was okay. And all this dark shit, not needed at all. Uh-huh. Like, 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 the amount of time that we're spending on this has not been needed. You know what was okay? When we were hanging out with Cynthia Weaver and she was yelling at us for being a dumbass. <laughs> This is interesting. Stuff falling on us is interesting. But all goddamn another battle arena. This is the not interesting stuff. The battle arenas aren't interesting. Can I get up? Oh good, it wasn't actually a battle arena. It just wanted to make you think it was one. Don't care about the goo. I do care about starting my timer. Oh yeah, now we get checkpoints every five seconds. <laughs> can do that for the longest shit areas the darkness where's her face yeah we know you got another fire watch over here yes we do is there another trapped fire watch nope but it looks like we're coming up on another battle arena That's what this game is. I now. don't wanna. I don't That's wanna. That's what this game is now. Alan, the action hero. Uh. Am I coming out here? Is that where I came in? Oh, over here. Hey, what happened to all those people that Sheriff Breaker was supposed to call? That Barry called, right? Yeah. Isn't somebody supposed to be helping me? Um, God, I don't even remember. Oh, do I have to go turn on power again? I need you to get the gym. Ah! Switch over the flashbang because I don't give a fuck. At least they refilled us on flashbangs. Mm mm. These type of generators, if you don't move quick enough, then they stop working. Those are chainsaw guys. Ugh. Unfair, unfair, unsafe business practices. So I 100% cheese that as much as possible. <laughs> I, wa I wasted all but one flashbang trying to take out those chainsaw guys without having to actually shoot them. At this point, yeah, we might as well just do it. I, I used up the flashbangs and I used up the, uh... No! No! That, God damn it, I thought it was a fence I had to open. Uh. Uh. I used up the flashbangs and several flares. We back up. Why would they have it rotate, though? Like, what does this serve? Like, in practical usage.
Oh, I wanted to make sure you saw the manuscript page. Of course. I can tell you're tired because you're not even talking anymore. I'm just I'm so exhausted. I... Whatever, I Barbara, care, Barbara. Who cares? Seriously. Honestly, Barbara, just save, 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 save it, save it. I don't even know anymore. Just save it. Like no one cares, Barbara. A guy behind me? Um, yeah. Wait, hold on. It might be a TV, it might be ammo in that house over there. I don't care. I just want to get to the end. Oh, I just want to get to the end. Do as you're told. Oh god, this, this seems like we're finally getting into a final sequence type of thing. <laughs> it's not just me, right? I, I it better, because it better, because I'm so done. I'm so done. So just done. had to slow me down, just to make me shoot another one of these stupid things. Just let me run through and have it be exciting when I'm running away. I don't care anymore. <clears throat> That's the end. <sighs> That's the end. Do you see it? This better be the end, Barbara. That's the pier. Just fucking book it. Go, 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 go. I'm doing my best. Go. Ah! Fuck off, Barbara. Alan's got a jog over there. Come on, really? Whatever, run! Just go! Seriously. Oh, uh, you can hit, it, hit us in the head all you want. I don't care anymore. Uh, that's a lot of flares. Ah! Fuck off! Oh, God. Why?! <laughs> Why? I hate it. <laughs> it's I so hate bad. It. So part of the problem was that there's things I was supposed to destroy walking up to it, and I said no. Oh. And the game was like, uh, yes. Ugh. <sighs> I don't know if there's anything I'm supposed to be doing differently. This is just what's happening. Is it working? Do I have to get closer? I'm gonna try getting closer. Hope okay. Doesn't fuck me over. You will fail. Shut up, Barbara. Why? Why? Wow. Why did the fucking boat have to come at that exact moment just to fuck me up? Yeah. Okay. Whatever. I don't care about winning anymore. I'll be fine if Alan bites it at the end. <laughs> okay, so we have to actually time the jump because as we all know, Alan Wake has always been a puzzle platform. <laughs> Am I close enough? Can I just shoot now?
<sighs> so not to spoil anything, but we're done with that section. Oh, thank God. I wanted to cry. We're not done with the game. We're into a different type of thing now. <laughs> we're back to story stuff. Because uh, you remember, Alan wrote that Thomas Zane wrote that Alan wrote that Alan gave himself a clicker as a child. I wonder how much of this game could have been solved by just trying to take our time. But why would we even bother? You were having a bad dream. <laughs> Alice, close your mouth. It was just another nightmare. No. Everything's fine. You're home. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Wow, that's not creepy at all. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on. Yeah, real Alice wouldn't be in the dark. Shh, baby. Out. There's no light. Come back to bed and nope. I'll make you forget all about your fear. Nope. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? Nope. You're not Alice. Turn the lights on. Just going on straight now. for the breaker. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? Damn it. Alan? You're scaring me now. Come back to bed. Have you taken your pills? You want There's to the call clicker. Dr. Hartman? Come back to bed, Alan. Ow. Come back wow. To I read your manuscript. It's brilliant. Oh, I have a flashlight now. Okay. Hey! Oh, hey, it's, it's Thomas. Friend, Thomas Zane. You must find your way to the cabin. That's the worst Big Daddy from Bioshock <laughs> ever. So what you're saying is we need to try and date the darkness. <laughs> oh god. Why are there two Allens? Uh, Don't mind him, yeah. he's Mr. Scott. Your friends will meet him when you're gone. What does this even mean? <laughs> is he supposed to look evil or is that just the game? Use the clicker. Uh, okay. Alright. We're in the final section, okay? Um, I don't know how long the final section is. We can either take a break here and then do the final section or just rush through to the end of the game. What do you want to do? I just wanted to end. All right, we're going to rush to the end of the game, so we might have a long episode. So we're creating stuff by shooting, it, shooting the words with light. <laughs> sure, okay. Don't actually need to focus either. I followed the idea of a path. Whatever. Alan's still giving himself notes. So we have to create a path. Oh, wow. Remember when we tried that's, to play the path? That's very poetic. Yeah, we did. We did not get very far with that. No. <laughs> we got a better way to record now if we ever wanted to go back what? to it. Yeah. And then we can get super knee deep into that. Uh, whatever that means. Because we love those kind of games in the media. So the darkness is trying to imply that Alan's been an abuser that kept his wife in the dark? Hmm. I don't think that's true. He's an asshole. But, like, that's because he's not getting proper therapy. Tom, let me go. I promise to be good. Please, I'm tiny, you naughty boy. 
Wow, okay, this is super weird. So, that'd be the dark... Does B or Zane have Alan's voice? Put that knife away, Thomas. Put it down. Heart is filled with darkness. Cut it out. Sorry. Sorry. Bird leg cabin. <laughs> is really making me laugh. I know I should be like, oh my god, Thomas Zane literally cut cut out the heart of the fake bar Barbara he back brought back to life. But I was just <sighs> kind of really focused on Bird Lake Cabin. Go faster. Oh, we didn't get to hear that phone call. Hmm. Get away from me, you hag! Where am I? Let me go! Alan! Alan! I'm coming! Your husband refused to do as he was told. All he had to do was write. Well, we cut off Barbara and her bullshit. Oh, thank God. Ugh. Glad we pushed on. I think this might legitimately now be the end of the game. Back. See, Thomas Dane cut out her heart. Oh. I am much older than you. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Someone else to dream me free. So there's a couple important questions. All right. Is Al Alice alive? Is Barry alive? Is Sarah? Breaker is it anything? Alive? Was was anything of any of this real? Oh, we're not done yet. Well, he st he stuck the clicker in her. Uh. So he filled her with light. <laughs> so now he's in the shadow part of the I lake. I feel Alice's presence close by. He's got a hole in the back of his pants. I understood what I had to do. I knew how to write the end of departure. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. So he's reversing time? Hmm. Who knew this was all going to end in time travel this whole time? <laughs> going back to the start of the week uh, to make it so events never happened. Wait. Hey. Oh, thank God. Break the surface, Alice. Come on. D hurry up. <laughs> We're kind of... You're going you're gonna to drown. Yay. What about Alan? Well, okay. So Alan said he needed to balance the scales. Uh-huh. Which means... It sounds like he's giving his life for Alice's life, right? Uh-huh. But here's my problem with that. Yeah. The scales were already imbalanced by the Dark Presence. Yeah. So how is Alan giving his life for Alice, balancing the scales, when the Dark Presence had already tipped them? Also, 
self-sacrifice is stupid. Yeah, I mean, like, now Alice has to live alone. That doesn't you know? really fix anything, Alice. God. Barry and Alice didn't exactly get along all the, all the time. Yeah, seriously. Like, she doesn't have a car. She doesn't have her keys. You know? Doesn't have her wallet. If it ends like this... Things are still going on, so let's let's, again, let's let's wait a bit. Don't you remember? We crossed literally every single part of this. Ugh, map that we've seen. I don't want to think. In about that it. final episode, we covered all of this shit. God damn. Deer fest. Hey, they get to have their deer fest after all. Yippee. And their float's not broken. Now there's the dock and Pat Main. Close your mouth, Pat. There's a... What was her name? Like, I, or I don't even know. There's the brothers! Yay! Yeah! Where's the doctor guy? I hope he's dead because he sucked. She's okay. Uh, there's also someone creepy looking at her from the background. That's not who, reassuring. Who was that? I don't know. I don't like it. I don't know who that was. It's an ocean. What? Alice, wake up. So you said it's not a lake, it's an ocean? By the way, that's the end of the game. I didn't get that last part. Okay, sure. So what he's saying is that the depth that he dove into, mm -hmm. the dark presence, the mm -hmm. dark presence wasn't the lake. The dark present. Here's my understanding. Without playing the, without playing the uh, other episodes. Uh huh. Because there's two DLC episodes. Yeah. That f that finish up the story. Yeah. Uh, he's. Imp I think he's saying that the dark presence is not the lake. The dark presence is a ocean of darkness. Okay. And he gave himself over to darkness, and only really contained. The equivalent of a lake in an ocean. So he's still stuck somewhere. <sighs> also, that was not Jim Cummings doing one of the voice of the old guys. It just sounded a lot like him. Uh. All right, so that was Alan Wake. Uh, what did you think? No. <laughs> Here's one thing I'll give. I'll give Sam Lake. His story was okay, <laughs> but the rest of it left some stuff to be desired. Like they could have, they could have set it up that the take, like it was like a, like a more mystery thing. And fighting the Taken was like a huge thing, not a not a rush of zombies, basically. Mm. I feel they, there's a lot they could have done better. Scream writing guys, I think you did okay. Programming guys, you guys could have done a lot better. I'm just yelling at the credits now. <laughs> All right, so removing the gameplay, what did you think of the story? Um, it was okay. I mean. That that's pretty much it. It was okay. Yeah, I, I I thought it had some interesting concepts. The whole mind fuckery with Alan wrote that Thomas wrote that Alan wrote that he added a clicker into his life <laughs> was weird. Um, <clears throat> yeah, you know, the fact like there are some interesting concepts with the the dark presence like giving life to things that people created. You know. But how much of it was like the brothers? Alan saw the brothers beforehand, right? Yeah. So were they actually rock gods? Or did he write them to be rock gods because he needed them to give him a message about how to save Alice? Hmm. So there's some interesting concepts that could be discussed about what really happened, what didn't happen, how much was made by Alan and how much was made by the Dark Presence and how much was reality. Um, 
The problem is the packaging. <laughs> like any of the puzzle platformer parts, like I once again, I don't remember my first time through. I remember there's areas I was frustrated my first time through and I'm like, I am tired of doing this. I would like to just get to the next section. But I thought it, I remember thinking it was an okay game and I liked the story. But playing it through now, like with somebody being uh, be able to talk to somebody about how frustrating it is, like, goddamn, this was really frustrating with a lot of points. It just drove on, dragged on for longer than it needed to. Uh, uh, yeah. All right. We're not going to finish watching the credits. <laughs> yep. We're back to the main page. Just looking at the episode list. So there's two other specials that uh, finish the story. There's mm. the signal and there's the writer. Mm. We're not doing those. No. And if we do, th if we do those, it'll be sometime in the future. Yes. It won't be right now. Yes. Here's our statistics. We're gonna look at our statistics real quick. Um. <laughs> so we got 331 kills with a revolver, mm -hmm. 94 g kills with the flare gun, 230, 233 with the shotgun, 114 with the Hunting rifle, 186 with the flashbangs. Nice. Indirect kills, I don't know what that means. <laughs> Look how many birds we killed. Oh my god. <laughs> also, also, we needed to use one more battery. Aww. If we were, if, oh, that would have been great if we would used one more battery. What, there was video games? Yep, I don't know where they were. Huh. I thought those, we those might, found those. We we found I think those I think those statistics are for the specials. We found all the radio shows and we found all the TV shows. Awesome. So I don't know what the science is. Yeah. Uh, we missed one. We missed one chat. This is between both gameplays, I think. Hmm. Uh. So there's canned pyramids to knock over, which I did because it was fun. Yeah. See, like eighty-four thermoses. We found one thermos. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I think the alarm clock, the alarm clocks, the standees, <laughs> and the Night Springs video games. I think those are for the specials. Uh, I I think the signs was the Firewatch stuff. I don't know because we had chests found, so I thought the chests were the Firewatch. Oh well, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so that was let's play Alan Wake. We thought the story was okay. We thought the gameplay was all right but really frustrating and dumb and dragged on for way too long in several places. Yes. All right, so I don't know when we'll get back to a horror game, but when we do get back to a horror game, we'll see you next time on Let's Try Horror. <clears throat> My voice is about to leave because I've been shouting <laughs> for the last hour. <laughs> okay. Uh, Shark Pup, you have any closing comments? Uh, this started off very interesting, and then it just sort of took a nosedive after a while. Uh, it wasn't that scary. I I think I was more scared because I had to do with dark stuff, and I'm very I'm very, I have fear of the dark, and that's about it. But overall, it was very boring. Yep, best part of the game, uh, the rockers, the yes, old metalheads. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Yep, and Barry. Yes, and Barry, and the, and the Barry, sheriff. Barry, metalheads, sheriff. Best parts of the game. The end. The end. Okay, bye, pals. <laughs> Oh, thank God.